僕が金になびく男に見えるとでも見えるわ。Is Vargas gonna say yes? My guy was so right. Oh my god, he actually barked. What's up, you guys? You boy f u r Senpai here, and today I'm gonna be reacting to The Eminence in Shadow Episode 3. But before I start today's reaction, I just wanna let you guys know that there was someone that put in the comment section on my first reaction, letting me know some information that the people that animated this went past over from the manga or the light novel. The person that commented on my first reaction was called Mini Alu. I believe I say her name right. But they put in some interesting information that the Animation went past over, and if it wasn't for the person that put it in the comment section and told me about this information that isn't like a spoiler or anything, and I kind of wish the anime itself actually put in that sequence or that scene because it would have made it 10 times more interesting and better for the anime. With that said, if you guys happen to enjoy my reaction on today's episode, hit that like button. And if you guys want to stick around and see my reaction for the fourth episode, hit that subscribe button if you guys haven't already. But that's pretty much all I got to talk about. Let's hop on to today's episode. <laughs> All right, so last episode, they just left us of a cliffhanger of Kid and the girl is just about to leave him, right? Because they had to say goodbye for some reason. Also, the funny thing is that the cult of the devil is, or the devil, is actually a real thing. Damn. So he had to, like, say bye bye to those guys. Wait, so is that it? Is that how we're gonna get to see the waifus? Aw,、oh, man. I wish we got to see more of them, honestly. I mean, we got to see Alpha and Beta, and I want to see more of the other girls. Wait, wait, what's he doing? Oh, wait. So they didn't skip this from the light novel. Oh, okay. Okay, so it looks like they, they actually put it in the animation. Oh, well, it doesn't matter.、It's, I'm still interested in t o this anime. There was no way knowing that they were actually gonna put that part in the animation because, but your explanation, it, you did a better job explaining the situation because that, I had no idea what was going on right there if you didn't explain it to me earlier. Oh,、uh, okay, so this is a place he's gonna be going to learn, I believe. <laughs> oh, that hairstyle. That has to be a thing, right? I'm pretty sure our character could, like, absolutely kick everybody's ass in the academy. That's 100% sure. Damn, just like in Japan, everything's crowded. Damn, son. Wait, so they're still considered nobles, but they're, like, low bottom nobles? Oh, damn, it's already been seven months that he's been in the academy. Well, it looks like he's blending in well. Wait! So that's the punishment? I'm only gonna take that. Wait, the girl in question is. Ooh, damn. Princess Alexia. Nice name, though. <laughs> you know what would be funny? If our character exactly asks her out and she says yes, that would be just too funny. Alright, so we're gonna get to see our background character, you know, ask her out. Oh, damn, he's actually scared. He looks nervous. Or is, is that just an act? <laughs> Even they're nervous. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, this has to be an act. There's no way he's this, like, nervous after all the shit he went through. Ah, I knew it. It was an act. I fucking knew it. So that's the way to make a Tunes Day fall for you, huh? Oh, wait, wait, wait. I'm kind of scared now. When people say it like that, it sounds like they're the people that would dominate you. <laughs> the wrong c o m p r o t a g o n i s t route. <laughs> so, not only did my boy, he also got the best girl under his hands. Dude, my guy is just too good to become a background character. I can't wait till she explains why she like, accepted it in the first place. Not gonna lie, she's cute. She's cute. I, I mean, I don't know. It's like because I, got, I like girls with silver hair. I don't know why, though. I like how everybody around them is like making it to a big thing. I mean, honestly, look at that. Look at that entree, bro. It could like feed 12 people, honestly. I got just scarfing it down like it doesn't matter. 
Oh, I see. So he's trying to get dumped. Oh, no. She enjoys this. Oh, no. Oh, no. Where's your eyes? Oh, this is only... This is only... Oh, this is terrible. Uh, dude, my guy, he's gonna die, I swear. Dude, I think she's, like, enjoying this more than he's enjoying himself. Oh, it looks like he's gonna be parring against his girlfriend. All right, let's see this happen. I'm, like, are those, like... Yeah, they're like real swords. So like, when do you get like, you know, hurt? What? She was copying his stretches. So she's aware about him. So she's like seeing how much he knows about, I guess, the strength of his own. Oh, what? What's with that look? Oh, so it looks like that guy asked her out before. Or oh, no, wait, is he the guy that's supposed to be engaged with her? Hmm. <laughs> Dude, our character doesn't give a fuck. <laughs> ah, I see. So they're the ones that convinced. Ah, okay, okay. I, I like how twisted she is, bro. I like how twisted she is. I'm not gonna lie. Whoa, what's that? Is that a coin? Wait, what does that coin do? What does that do? Why was he so surprised? Is that... Like a thousand pounds or something? <laughs> Is Vare gonna say yes? <laughs> my guy was so right. Oh my god, he actually barked! I mean, hey, you gotta do what you gotta do for the eminence of the shadow, my guy. Oh man, <laughs> this character is funny, bro. I love this character. <laughs> I love how she's like saying all her complaints to our boy, but really he doesn't really care about the situation. Hey, ice cream. Man, I haven't had ice cream in a while. Ice cream looks really nice. Oh, so is he actually like a bad guy or something? <laughs> flaws. Oh, so does like the popular guy have any flaws? Wow, she just really puts it bluntly, huh? <laughs> Wait, he has no flaws. Then what? I, the more you hate the guy. <laughs> hey, yo, money talks, money talks. You know, I gotta say, at this point, Alexa, she's gonna have to end up having feelings, right? I mean, she's been playing this role for a bit too long. Oh, whoa, he's actually talking back. No, I think she's like in the same situation as our main character because it looks like she is like the background character compared to her sister. Wait, there's absolutely no one in the train now that I notice. Oh, I know Kid is not a great person. He just murders people, bro. I mean, of course, bad guys. Oh, so he actually means that by heart. Does he? I mean, he's just saying it because he just means it, I believe. <laughs> Are they not gonna say nothing? Oh, another goodbye. Oh, finally. If it's over, finally. Oh, hey, it's that guy. Wait, what's what's going on? Wait, why are they there? Uh oh. Only bad things are gonna approach. Oh my god, no, they're gonna try to pin it on him! Fuck! Oh, I mean, I'm pretty sure you could take them down, but for the sake of the people around him, he's willing to cooperate. <laughs> I was in big trouble. <laughs> Wow, man, what a what a great, interesting episode today was. I was really expecting, like, you know, the amazing girls to come back. But it looks like they're not going to be back for a while, or maybe not at all. <laughs> Time to review today's episode. So after the little event of the girls leaving, it looks like our character Sid has decided to go to the academy. Which, of course, would be the next move for his big operations of as the eminence of shadows. In shadows, I mean. 
With that said, for his time being there in the academy, he tries his best to blend in with the other low class nobles, I believe, because I guess there's even a ranking in the noble, which is kind of weird, but I guess it works. And also, just to clear up things of that person that commented on that first video, I do appreciate it, and I don't think that was a spoiler to me, to be exact, because I feel like the people that animated this they should have put it in the beginning as well but they just decided to put it in some random part in today's episode so even when they showed it in the anime on today's episode it felt really off and kind of weird and i didn't really know what was like going on we were just seeing our main character hitting his head on it looked like a rock and not a tree and then just runs into the street and you know gets killed but compared to the person that commented it made a lot more sense and understandable to know what the situation was so i'm not gonna say it's your fault it's up to the anime of how they animated it so you know you're in a clear man I, I don't expect you to get like banned or your comment deleted and our guy kid how he was like forced as a punishment to ask the most beautiful girl in the academy to ask her out i wasn't really surprised that she said yes but still it made me laugh and i was just not expecting the way that she said it was you know was gonna happen but it really took me by surprise of how the character was acting and then it slowly got to me where he was like oh he's just acting he's just trying to play that role to where the girl would just say no but she actually said yes but the only reason why she said yes was because she needed someone as like lousy as a boyfriend of a low noble so then she could convince a different guy that is just like the most perfect chad guy ever just to leave her alone of course it doesn't really work out the way but the way that the character sees it, the longer he stays with her, the more money he gets for the funding of his operation of the Eminence in Shadow. But God, man, I love my character, man. He just like says the most simplest things in the worst situation ever. Just like at the very ending when Alexia was kidnapped, apparently, and everyone suspected that the MC was the person that, you know, kidnapped her, I believe. And at the very end, when he was like kneeing down to surrender, he just said, man i'm in big trouble <laughs> like yeah no duh you are but like the way he said it just was more funny but yeah i'm kind of curious how he's gonna like get out of that situation if he has like any proof to tell the other guys or if they're actually gonna like listen to the dude because i feel like they're not gonna listen to him at all but anyways if you guys happen to enjoy my reaction on today's episode hit that like button if you guys want to see my reaction on the fourth episode hit that subscribe button if you guys haven't already but this is all i gotta talk about it's been your boy Perez senpai and i'll see you guys in the next episode